Newbie reporting for duty with the FJX Imperium. It's Saturday morning for me, and I think it's time to pull a sniper into the small map mosh pit. First, let's look at the configuration. We're going to start with the FJX Lux 7 stock that increases our movement speed up to 2.3 meters per second. That's a composite of all the attachments. Look at the tack speed with a sniper, 6.7 meters per second and a healthy sprint speed at 5.6 meters per second. There are no downsides to this attachment. The FJX Blast Bolt, it's a must. It increases the rate of fire by 14% to about 60 rounds per minute, one every second, and it decreases the rechamber time by 6%, which is 1,533 milliseconds, a second and a half a rechamber. So we got to keep that in mind. It's a bit slow. The Skull 40 Grip. And that helps with the ADS speed by almost 10%. Hurts the recoil, the gun kick, the horizontal recoil, the vertical recoil. But if you're recoiling, you're twitching on the ground because you bought the farm. You missed your shot. Sprint to fire speed, 21%. Decrease with this attachment, that's 199 millisecond sprint to fire speed. That is blistering for any weapon in the game. The Moore's Dot Sight, it increases the ADS movement speed by 15%. That's 2.3 meters per second. Again, it's a composite of all the attachments, and it helps the ADS speed aim down sight by 10%. The VLK LZR 7 milliwatt laser, you know, Grandpa doesn't like lasers in general, but this one helps ADS speed by 5%. And sprint to fire speed, it's part of that 199 millisecond composite. So we're going to try it out. But if I feel people are tracking the laser, Grandpa's going to ditch it. So let's take the FJX Imperium onto the field of honor and see how we did. We're looking to get rust for the first map and a gack right off the bell. Surprise that, poor guy. I think the Imperium is one of the best three snipers, top three in the game. It's an OG weapon, but it really aims down sight fast, it moves fast, and it packs a big punch. The only thing it could improve <laughs> is my aim, but actually the damage, when you look at it, it's world class for a sniper all the way down to the lower torso. It's going to be a one-shot gack, and the mobility is spectacular. 4.4 meters per second movement. Look at the sprint speed, but look at the ADS. It's on the faster side for a sniper, as is the sprint to fire speed. Now, you probably need to use the quick grip gloves if you're going to do a swap out because 2.3 seconds is fairly slow. So let's bring this thing around rust, and... I consider Rust a more medium map, not a small map, but we're fortunate it's in the small map mosh pit. I usually put my horizontal controller at 13 when I'm sniping, 11 to 13 range, but it's okay at 5 or 6 too. You're just not going to get the following the guys laterally at a distance kills and certainly not up close it's going to be more difficult got to do a lot more movement let's get that guy off the flag we've gotten pretty far behind um, i'm trying to take flags it appears my teammates are prancing about going for kills oh <laughs> there was a guy ads let's see if we can take b nope Grandpa buys the farm. Pretty disappointing first game. The weapons perform spectacularly, but let's go to a true small map, which is shipment. Sniping on shipment, I love doing it. It's challenging. You hold the grenade. And Grandpa is going to get on the hard point. 
and see if he can soak and see if he can buy the farm. Good indication, taking the lead at the beginning there. You can see how well, how powerful the Imperium is. Uh, if it weren't for the Stalker, I would think this would be the best classic sniper in the game. Of course, the Moors in the sniper category, in my opinion, comes in second to the XRK, mainly for ADS, for power, that sort of consideration. But the Imperium is a strong third place. <laughs> yeah. But I got a team that's jumping on the hard point to relieve some of the pressure off old grandpa because his games are generally pressure packed unless it's team deathmatch where everybody prances about the outside in their sailor suits and goes for kills. Grandpa's going for soaking. He's going for the win. Where are they? There we go. Getting back on the hard point. Poor guy just spawned. Got a mosquito drone. We'll put that out. We're building a pretty good lead. Whoa. <laughs> that was a surprise. Good morning, Starshine. The earth says hello. There's Night Cream Face. And there she is again. Get a triple kill off of that one. And we're soaking. Somebody sniffing their feet, walking slowly. If you're going to sniff your feet, you better pull the trigger. Here, hold that for a second. There's another one for you. Where are you? Oh, back in the corner, and you had the jump on Grandpa. Put out the mosquito. Go do work, my child. Soaking at the hard point. Whoa. Sniffing feet again. Doesn't work if you're not pulling the trigger. And you're walking that slow. ads And whoa. We got napalmed. That's illegal. Geneva Convention. And we win. Grandpa soaked for 257. That's a good one. Don't care about the kills as much. Please like and subscribe. Peace.